Dave from Soul Asylum. Hello, Piper. <laughs> What's your favorite snack to eat while watching a movie? My favorite snack to eat while I'm watching, well, that's an easy one, popcorn. And I make really good popcorn and I make it in a kettle on the stove and it tastes better than microwave popcorn. But sometimes you gotta deal with what you got, but definitely popcorn. If you had a time machine, would you go? Would you rather go 100 years into the future or 100 years into the past? Mm, that's a good question. I'm gonna go with the 100 years into the future because I think I, well, that's a really good question though because I like history and if you go into the past you can see what it was really like, not what one book says it was like and another book says something different and this and that and the other thing. But if I had to choose, I'd go into the future. If you could play the lead role in a movie about somebody's life other than your own, who would you play? Ooh, that's a good question. Uh, <laughs> that's a really good question. Um, let me see. I'm going to go with a hard one. I'm gonna go with Leonardo da Vinci. He's just super smart and he's a great painter and he knew all this stuff before everybody else did and I think that'd be an interesting person to be. Do you ever daydream during a concert? Do I ever daydream during a concert? Well, sometimes I start thinking about like, oh there's that person. I didn't know they were there so I'll recognize somebody in the crowd. And then I'll start thinking, oh, I wonder how they got here. I wonder if they took a car or a plane. And then I'm like, oh, I'm getting distracted. <laughs> Is there anything special that you've kept since you were a kid? Hmm. I save a lot of things. Uh, I probably saved my first autograph from J.P. Parisi, who was my favorite hockey player when I was a kid. And now he has a son called Zachary Parisi who plays for the Minnesota Wild. And I like watching him play because he reminds me of his dad. But I know I don't know exactly where it is, but I know I still have my JP Parisi autograph picture. What food you what food would you not eat even if I get offered you a hundred dollars? If you offered me a hundred dollars to eat something. Uh, I'm gonna go with I can't say the S word. That's supposed to be funny. I know it's terribly inappropriate, but I'm gonna go with baby corn. Those little tiny corns, they freak me out. I don't understand. Do they grow on little tiny corn stalks? They come out of a can, baby corn. Ah, I don't think I'd do it. If you could hold a wor world record, what would it be for? If I could hold a, uh, uh, a world record, I guess it would probably be selling more records than anybody else. <laughs> that's a record, that's a double entendre or something. And finally, can you name all the Spice Girls? No, but I will try. There's Sporty Spice, there's Ginger Spice, there's Scary Spice, there's the girl with the red hair, did I miss her? Thank you. No, that's Ginger, of course that makes sense. Sporty, Ginger, two, there's Sleepy Spice, there's sn Snuffy, Grouchy Spice, fit, Saucy Spice, is Saucy Spice one of them? A spicy Spice. <laughs> um, <laughs> now I'm thinking of the Seven Dwarfs. There's, uh, there's not a Goofy Spice, is there? Is there a Silver Spice Sermon? Is there a few? Give me a hint. Um. Uh, There's five, right? And I got three. Pacifier. Baby Spice. Yes. yes. All right, which one am I missing? Posh. Posh. That's the one that uh, is with the uh, Bend of Like Beckham. Is that the right? I got that? All right. Thank you. Thank you very much. That was fun.